Yo, what is up, YouTube? I'm back with another video, and today's video is strictly for all you out there that's out here trying to resell Kobe sneakers that you had for years, and you're just trying to get rid of them now. You're going out to Nike stores, buying them for retail, trying to get $500 off of them after his death, trying to profit off of it. It's just crazy because, like, this man spent his whole life and career playing basketball for all of us. He was literally everyone's favorite basketball player. It was either MJ, LeBron, Kobe, Larry Bird, et cetera, et cetera. And it's like, y'all can't, y'all, like, y'all don't even know how to act. Y'all here, like, praising his death, out here trying to profit off his shoes. Like, I see all the posts on TikTok, Instagram. Everybody's doing, like, hashtag RP Kobe, hashtag reselling, hashtag hype beast. Like, y'all here trying to profit off this man's legacy and his shoes and it's like what is what's wrong with y'all why do why do y'all why do y'all like what are y'all getting out of this money money isn't everything his family lost their daughter him friends and y'all just don't know that y'all here posting his shoes on stock x reselling them i'm surprised stock x is even going through with this nike they already took his shoes off the website because they already knew what was going to happen they were the first to do it they already knew what was going to happen and Honestly, I agree with what they did. They took them off Nike, but I mean, there's still people going in the store getting them. I mean, I can see if you're like actual Kobe fan and you want the shoe, like you want to buy the shoe to keep it. But like, if you're buying the shoe to just go out and flip it the next day, like, what are you doing? What's your problem? Like, if you, if one of you guys are watching this video and you're out here reselling his shoes, please comment. Tell me why are you reselling his shoes? I need to know because it's just disrespectful and it's like what if like your brother just like what if your famous brother just died yesterday and then you just decided or like your friends just decided or anybody just decided to go out take his clothes and resell them for profit how would you feel yeah exactly you'll 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 feel pretty pretty disrespected you'll you'll be like yo what's wrong with you like what's your problem like what's going on why are you doing this because it's messed up it's messed up and all y'all need to stop it's not the move it's 2020 y'all should not be acting like this kobe Bryant built his legacy off basketball his mamba mentality and you guys are just trying to destroy it you guys are trying to blame lebron for his death you guys are trying to do all these things to just mess with people's head and just make them turn on everybody and resell his shoes talk bad about lebron it's just nah. It's a crazy world we live in today, and honestly, I wish you guys would just do better. Like, just do better. What's wrong with y'all? It's sad. It's a sad world we live in. And if you agree with me, let me know in the comment section. Um, this is pretty much all I had to say for this video. RP to the GOAT. Kobe Bryant, you will be missed. One of my favorite players, and honestly, once I got the news, all I could think about was growing up begging my dad for a pair of Kobe Bryant. I forget which ones they were, but I was begging my dad for Kobe. He's like, dad, can you, can you please get me these Kobe's? Can you please get me these Kobe's? And him always saying no, because we couldn't afford it. And just playing 2K with my brother screaming, he to go, he to go, get off me. And then my brother's punching me because I always took the W with the Lakers. Bro, it's sad, it's honestly sad. Like we lost one of the greatest basketball players in history. And the way he went out, he shouldn't have went out that way. Like. Who would have thought a helicopter crash would have been this man's death? Like, with his daughter, it's so, bro, like, bro. It's so tragic. Uh, I'm praying for his family. Uh, hopefully they could all get through this. And it's, it's hard, man. Like, it's gonna be hard. All I can think about is his family that he left behind and just what they gotta go through. That's, that's a tough loss. Like, losing your sister, your dad, friends in this way like that's it's it's crazy it's sad it's sad and then them getting the news people are selling his shoes for six hundred dollars after his death like profiting off of it that's another thing to think about like they just got so much going his family just has so much running through their head right now and y'all just don't know how to act like calm down sit chill relax grieve y'all just want to make money so quick like chill but yeah like i was saying that's all i wanted to get on here and say i just wanted to add my 10 cents tell you guys my opinion on the situation um it, it, it just it's been bothering me seeing all this seeing all these news reports resellers trying to sell the shoes it's it's been bothering me man and 
honestly, it's sad. Man, y'all need to just think about what y'all doing before y'all resell these shoes. Like, y'all look really, really bad. And the people that's buying the shoes, bro. It's, it's bad. But, um, yeah. RP to go. RP Kobe Bryant. We love you. 24, 8. Peace.